Hey everybody, welcome to Bob and Kevin's Beer Reviews. Summer is right around the corner, so yeah. we decided we were going to do a lot of um, summer type beers. And there's so many out there, mm -hmm. there's got to be about 20 of them. We can't possibly do them all. We've got four tonight. Mm -hmm. We've got two Shandies, an ale, a summer ale, and then we have a Kentucky Old Fashioned Barrel Ale that was produced for the summer. So let's get it started, Kevin, and you're cooler. First up, Curious Traveler. I just think they, they're they easy drinking, damn tasty, refreshing. Yeah. I like them, and you like them. Yes. All right, so we like them, right? Let's do it. Just want to say, uh, do we have a Traveler cap? Uh, I believe we do. We yes, do. I see one okay. right there. Yes, All we right. do. Nice cap, nice bottle. Mm -hmm. I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with the Traveler beer out of Vermont and uh, their logo with the uh, mustache. Yeah. The handlebar mustaches. It's great. Yeah, it's a, it's, it's a pretty whimsical comment. Yeah, yeah, I love it. It's funny. It's a yeah. good label. And we've liked some of their other beers. Yeah. We've reviewed some of their other beers in the past. And Does it give you the alcohol on that? Nope, not that I can see it. Um, it just says, uh, ale brewed with lemon peel with natural flavors added. So that's pretty much all it says. Um, it's an American craft shandy. Okay, let's That's do it. Call it. You ready? Let's get let's get let's get right into this. Yeah. I don't remember. We've up to like sixty beers we reviewed now. Did mm. we have we reviewed other shandies last summer, last year? When we first started, didn't we do some? No, because yeah. I, I believe we we started in the winter. Yeah, well, so I, we should I don't have grabbed we, the Gansett shandy. Yeah. You we know. will. We'll get so, to it. Yeah, we'll we'll we'll, we'll get to it, right? We're gonna right we're now still we're gonna concentrate East Coast here. on the summer beers, you yeah. know? Oh yeah. Let's do it. All right, let's do it. All right, we're going to share a beer yeah, tonight. we got a lot of beers. Right, so just so we can get through the beers. And uh, we're also, we have a bottle of Stony Brook Red. And, For our dessert. Uh, we've reviewed yeah. that already. So we've already we're, reviewed we're it. We loved it. We gave it a 10. Yeah, with the highest um, rating we ever gave out, yeah. Sam Adams Stony Brook Red Barrel Room Series in the Growlers with the cork. Mm -hmm. Highly recommended, if you can find that one. That one is snapped up off the shelves quickly. Mm -hmm. Got mine at Anthony's Liquors today, Tile Cabin Carpentry. Ken sent Kevin down, there was one left, he got there, was gone. Yep. In a Go matter on. of minutes. Yeah. And, and um, I'm so thirsty. I looked it up online, and uh, it didn't get great reviews. It got good reviews, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But it didn't get great reviews. So, like, but we really, really like it. Evidently, other people like it, too, because yeah. it's hard to get, and <clears throat> it's hopping off the shelves. So, mm -hmm. um, all right. So, are you ready to dive into this one? Not yeah, that I, one? I'm, like I said, I'm thirsty. Right. I'm Let's give it a smell. Yep. Yeah. Instant lemon. Lots of yeah. lemon aroma. Yeah. Typical lemon shandy. It's got, yeah. It looks kind of like a wheat beer. It's kind of cloudy. I don't yeah. Know if it it's an un unfiltered. Unfiltered. Yep. Yeah. It's definitely unfiltered. It's got like a, it almost looks like crushed lemons, the color. Yeah. You know, it, exactly. It's, it's good, a pale, good description. Crushed pale yellow lemons. I like that. Color. All right. You know what? All right. We should do that in the corner of the golf course. <clears throat> oh, so you're going in? Yeah, I'm in. All right. I couldn't wait. So I, I guess I'll go in. Get in All there. All right. Okay. Yep. I was waiting for you to stop talking. I only got like three steps. Say go in. I tell you, it's um, it's lemony, but it's not too overpowering. I, I think you're getting a nice balance, very smooth, very it's it, it's a tart lemon taste, mm. very refreshing. Before On a hot day, if it was say say you're out cutting the lawn, it's ninety out and or eighty five even, and you're, you're sweating like a bastard, and you reach in an ice cold cooler and pull that thing out, it is gonna be so refreshing. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Yeah. You can hang with this for a while. I can hang with it for a while. Not all day. I'll stop getting that uh, citrus too much, you know? Yeah, too much. Yeah, and, and it's a but, little sweet. Yeah. So, yeah. But they all, all day, but, you know, you know I you know, could hang with this for a while. Definitely. You know what I mean? Highly for, recommend for it for uh, the beach, volleyball, mm -hmm. and whatever you may up, be up to. Doing yard work. This, this is a hang during the day beer. Great for summertime. Yeah. Good job. Absolutely, yeah. Refreshing. Mm -hmm. You know, it sets out what it... You know what I mean? It, it it accomplishes what it sets out to do. I am done with my curious traveler. I'm gonna take a close look at the bottle while Kevin finishes up because mm. I'm a little curious. The American Craft Shandy, it says. 
that's pretty much it. Ale brew with lemon peel with natural flavors added, just like Kevin said. Oh, here it is, 4.4% alcohol. So it's not okay. too powerful, you know. You ready to rate this? Yeah, I'm ready to rate it. You know, we're going quick tonight. We got yep. four beers. We're yep. trying to get in there yep. quick. <clears throat> All right. I'm going to give this a five. Wow. For Shandy style. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm not rating this against other beers. There's too many categories. I'm breaking it into a category. This is a Shandy. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give it a five for its hangability, its taste, its tautness, and its sweetness. Or I think it's well balanced. I'm giving it a five. Okay. If we are rating it in the Shandy scale That's and not overall to. beer scale okay and i agree with yeah. you i yeah. agree with you i gotta change it because originally i was going to give it a three and a half yeah all right yeah. so if we're rating in the shandy yeah. and we and i it. am in my head thinking of the other shandies mm -hmm. all right because we've had a lot of them yeah all right i'm gonna give it a six. Oh wow cool. so well because i hope to give one of the shandies a 10 in the shandy category yeah you know what i mean so i'm gonna give it a six so, okay all right. Curious Traveler. Shandy, Bob comes in at a five, and Kevin at a seven. Hey, that was good. That was a that good, was beer. good, good right? beer. What'd you think? You I like it? it? I yeah. liked it. I'm anxious if to get some next Somebody offered one. it to me. Yeah. You know, I, I would take it. So uh, let's, uh, you know, um, we're going to put this one in the... Uh, in the bag. We're going to put that this one in the recycle bin. Yeah. And uh, we're going to call it a night. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.